Hey, St. Luke, St. Luke fam. Now, well wishers, our friends, this is the day that the Lord has made. Let's rejoice and let's be glad today. I mean, the first thing I need to do is thank all of you who reached out to say happy birthday to the old man on yesterday. Uh, it was the 31st celebration of my 39th birthday. I hope everybody got that right. The 31st celebration. I've celebrated 39, 31 times uh, now. And no, I'm not ashamed of my age or anything like that. I just celebrate 39, 31 times. And next year, it'll be 32. All right, thank all of you for the gifts, the cards for Sunday. They tricked me. finally got close to surprising me um, with a birthday celebration that shortly after service. And then last night, I had a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful uh dinner with uh, children and grandchildren and loved ones. I'm so thankful for each of them for uh, just thinking about blessing the old man. I uh, had a great time um, doing it. I'm, I'm thankful to them. I thank God. I pray that God will continue to bless um, each of each of them. I'm so thankful. I'm, I'm loved and uh, yeah, yes, yeah, so I'm just thankful. Okay, enough of that mushy stuff. It's announcements time. Let's look at our midweek announcement. Uh, Virtuous Vessels. These, this is a ministry for uh, young girls, uh, fifth through eighth grade. Virtuous, Virtuous Vessels. It's that equip the young ladies uh, to be who God created them to be. Um, it's a safe space. Uh, for sharing and serving others, and our own minister, Natasha McCreary, is going to um, uh, lead that ministry, I believe, Sister, uh, Minister Natasha McCreary. We thank God for her, and we pray God for, uh, that God will bless the ministry in a way that those young ladies will uh, be blessed to grow up to be uh, solid for the Lord. Our food pantry ministry is still asking, accepting donations. If you would, would you please? And I think it's online. The stuff that they're looking for, stuff like tuna fish, peanut butter, jelly can, soup, oatmeal, canned fruit, soap, lotion, detergent, you know, deodorant, toothpastes, uh, toothbrushes, applesauce. So they're looking for things that we can give out here. I believe that in this season, of inflation, uh, we're going to see an uptick, we are seeing an uptick, people in just basic needs, so you are the hand of God, and God has blessed you to be a, a, a storage uh, abundantly, so you can be available to share uh, with others, so we thank God for all you've done historically, and I, I, I thank God for you. So, if you have some of these things, you want to go get some of these things, bring them out, put them in the food pantry. We help. We help. I know, uh, yeah, we, we help. I mean, we can only help uh, if you participate with it. We thank God for you. We just know it's going to work out well. Be sure to keep in, on our prayer list, Sister um, Euro Reeves. She lost her brother. Uh, Mr. Alex Reeves, that uh, funeral, I think it's going to be this Saturday, I believe, if you know you uh, keep her and that family in your prayers. Uh, also keep Brother Terry Johnson in prayer as he heads into, into surgery. Um, Brother Mingo Ponder and, and others, Sister Mother Jackson, uh, Kyra, um, Thompson, um, Sister Flowers, Sister uh, DeVance, keep them in prayer, Tiny Ellison, Deacon uh, Willie Ellison, um, yeah, keep, keep Tiny in prayer, um, and Deacon Ellison, keep them in prayer, Sister J Wanda Jackson, uh, Sister Loretta Mahone, Brother Billy Burns, Sister and Mother Pauline Foreman, um, keep them in prayer. One of my daughter's sisters, Anika, keep Anika in prayer as 
as well, and that may be Elvis, Sister Sh Sheila Rashid. Um, I did say Willie Ellison, Willie Ellison and Sister Tiny are the same Ellison, Deacon Clarence Ellison. Uh, and so to make sure you keep them in, in prayer. So as we, uh, as we pray, if we missed, uh, if we missed someone, be sure to call in, put your name on the prayer list. I believe that prayer changes things. I keep Sister Sheila Carter and Sister Linda Williams as well in in prayer. Don't forget to mention them to look to the Lord uh, in in prayer. Now um, we'll be looking, uh, making more announcements about conference. Uh, we, Getting it ready. It's coming along slowly. And also, your tax returns are available for those who want to pick up your state tax or contribution statements to St. Luke. Uh, you can do that. And those of you who work, you should be able to get your W-2s and 1099s, whichever one. Um, they're available when they're here at the church. All you have to do is call and come by and and get them somewhere between 9 and 4, Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, 9 and 2 on Wednesdays, 9 and noon on, on Saturday. We also are looking at a project in Selma. We reached out to the community there uh, to see what we can do to um, be a blessing in Selma. We also reached out to Griffin, Georgia. I made a contact, got a call from there. As soon as we get it down, to figure out what's the best avenue for for assistance, we will uh, we'll, we'll do that as well, and we'll let you know about that. So, Selma, Alabama, uh, we understand there. There's much need there. Uh, in Griffin, Georgia, uh, was hit uh, by the storm a few weeks ago. So we're going to try to respond to that need, and I will keep you informed. This is Pastor Johnson. God bless you. We'll see you in a few moments with word and with worship. Be blessed.